Hi, I am Sayyad and you are watching Automotive Revolution. If you are new to my channel please subscribe. This video is about the evolution of Hyundai Elantra from 1990 to present 2025. The Hyundai Elantra, also known as the Hyundai Avante, is a compact car produced by the South Korean manufacturer Hyundai since 1990. The Elantra was initially marketed as the Lantra in Australia and some European markets. In other markets, the name Avante is not used due to its similarity with Audi's Avant designation, which is used for their lineup of station wagons. The name was standardized as Elantra worldwide in 2001 except in South Korea, Singapore and Russia. The first generation Elantra codename J1 was launched in October 1990. The Elantra was powered by a Mitsubishi-designed 1.6-liter straight 4 and produced 113 PS. Top speed was 187 km per hour. Other engine options were 1.4-liter, 1.5-liter, 1.7-liter, 1.8-liter mated to 5-speed manual and 4-speed automatic transmission. The vehicle was refreshed in 1992 for the European market, adding Hyundai's current logo to the grille, although North American models retained the previous year's look. The second generation was launched in 1995. At launch, a 1.5-liter Alpha SOHC inline-four engine and 1.8-liter Beta DOHC gasoline inline-four engine were available domestically. Later, a 1.5-liter lean-burn gasoline engine based on the Alpha DOHC engine was added. The Philippine version and European markets had the 1.6 liter. These were mated to either 5 speed manual or 4 speed automatic transmission. New grills arrived in 1998 for the 1999 model year. A PSA built 1.9 liter naturally aspired diesel option was also added for some European markets. The third generation Elantra was launched in 2000. The station wagon version was dropped in favor of a five-door liftback. Starting in 2001, the XD was available with 1.6, 1.8 and 2.0-liter gasoline engines and a 2.0-liter turbo diesel. These were mated to five-speed manual or four-speed automatic transmission. In 2004, all models were refreshed with new headlights and taillights, a new grille, updated front and rear bumpers with a split lower grille. A redesigned fourth-generation sedan debuted at the 2006 New York International Auto Show for the 2007 model year. The engine lineup included 1.6-liter Gamma and 2.0-liter Beta the second gasoline inline-four engines and a 1.6-liter turbodiesel inline-four. A five-speed manual transmission was standard with an optional four-speed automatic. Beijing Hyundai launched a redesigned Elantra called the Elantra Yue Dong for the Chinese market with an updated exterior and a separate facelifted 2011 Elantra model. The model was later updated in 2017 and is currently known as the Hyundai Celesta. The fifth generation Avante debuted at the 2010 Pusan International Motor Show. For the US and Canadian market, it featured a new 1.8-liter gasoline engine. In other markets, it featured a 1.6-liter gasoline direct injection engine, mated to a new six-speed automatic or manual transmission. For the 2014 model year, the Elantra sedan received significant updates. The GLS trim was changed to Shea and an all-new Elantra Sport was now available with a more powerful 2.0-liter GDI engine. Elantra Langdong is a longer version of Elantra for the Chinese market. Released in August 2012, production models included a choice of 1.6-liter MPI engine rated at 126 horsepower and 1.8-liter MPI engines rated at 144 horsepower mated to six-speed manual and automatic transmissions. The sixth-generation Elantra was launched in South Korea as the Avante in September 2015. Various engine options were offered for different markets including 1.4-liter, 1.6-liter, 2-liter petrol and 1.6-liter diesel engine. These were mated to either 6-speed manual, 6-speed automatic, 7-speed DCT and CVT. Roughly halfway through the 2017 model year, Hyundai released a sport model for the North American market. 
The Sport featured a turbocharged 1.6-litre direct-injected i4 producing 201 horsepower. Transmission options included a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic with manual shift mode or a traditional 6-speed manual. On 6 September 2018, the facelifted Avante was launched in South Korea. It received a new exterior look, new wheel designs, new safety features and an updated center stack. The seventh generation Elantra, which was released for the 2021 model year, was unveiled on the 17th of March 2020 in West Hollywood, with model code name CN7. It was selected as the 2021 North American Car of the Year. It offer 1.4-liter, 1.5-liter SmartStream i4, 1.6-liter Gamma MPRI4, 2.0-liter SmartStream and 2.0-liter Theta 2 TGDI inline-4 engines option for various markets. These were mated to 6-speed manual, 6-speed automatic, 7-speed DCT, 8-speed DCT. In July 2021, the Elantra N, also known in some markets as the Avante N and the i30 Sedan N, was announced as the performance model of the Elantra under the Hyundai N sub-brand. The vehicle is powered by a 2.0-litre turbocharged inline 4 theta 2 engine rated at a maximum of 276 horsepower. It is available with either a 6-speed manual transmission or an 8-speed wet-type DCT. On April 18, 2023, Hyundai unveiled the facelifted Elantra N, which features a similar redesigned front and rear end to the standard Elantra. The facelifted Elantra N was launched in the Philippines on April 4, 2024. Thanks for watching Automotive Revolution. Please subscribe my channel.